Okay, we're out here at the East Bay or Alameda Creek Stables. Got some nice soft dirt. See that? Hope you can see that anyway. So uh, it's kind of like a sandy dirt. So we, uh, if we do uh, take a dive, oh, it's got a GPS lock on it, and I am in safe mode. Ready. All right, let's see what happens here. I don't know if these batteries are very good. Tell you the truth, uh, they're old lipos. Because I'm already flashing several colors here. Or maybe it, since they're only 15C batteries, maybe they just don't have the discharge rate. Uh, keep putting the throttle up, just try to stay in the air. That's, that's all the way up throttle. I don't think these batteries are going to work very well. The uh, double sticky tape on the green light didn't uh, take. You know what happened? I think when I tipped it up, I got dirt in the motor. Yep. That uh, just happened to have crashed at that point, though. Oh, huh. I gotta start over again. Crash sand. Yeah. Green sand and motor. And uh, didn't start up. All right, here we go again. I'm a little bit crooked from where I uh, wanted to be. I'm not pointed in the right direction. Lock already, cool. Alright, all the props are running this time. Ah, we'll take it up. Yeah, I think if I want to use bigger batteries, I'm going to have to get uh, 30 or 50 C's. At least this one's not flashing uh, red, green, blue. Still not flashing, so I don't know how long. Oh crap, I didn't even set my timer, so I don't know. I'm in safe mode, so all the stick movement is relative. I'm at least trying to uh, keep the red end going forward. And then I'm going to try to do the bind without GPS. Should hit a I'm in a safe circle area here. Won't go any further. Okay, I'm going to try a return to home. All right. Now, let's see if I can bind this with GPS disabled. Where's my little launching pad here? I think it's right here. Okay, yep, there's my little spots. Okay, it's in, uh, I thought it was supposed to be flashing blue for bind mode. Oh, now it's in bind mode. There's bind mode. Stick over, switch up, turn it on. And I'm going to start over again. I'll be back. I'm going to shut the camera off. I'll be back if I get this thing. Okay, it's way over there, but I'm in. I bound it with no GPS or GPS disabled. Just trying to get it to hover. Oh, 
Alright. See, they should have timed this again. Well, I don't know if you saw that, but uh, took a sudden dive. Battery flew out. These batteries aren't, uh, aren't Velcroed down. Went into a sudden backflip. Let's see. Doesn't appear anything broke except the crop. It bent. I don't know if you can see that. It's a broken arm prop. The one that broke last time. I got dirt in it, I can tell that. Took a nosedive into the dust. Yeah, this one's got dust in it too. Those two are okay. So it looks like this arm and this one, which is number one and number four, took a dive into the ground. I can't remember which position I was pointing at, but it looks like it went this way into the ground. This green pop, so got dirt in the motor because it's jamming up. Yeah. Okay, got the dirt out, but the pops had it. Uh, I don't know if I get the right angle on here, but you can see that prop has been bent back. Plastic has a crease, has a crease in it now. The orange ones, that looks okay. It's got promise as far as using this frame. Needs a few tweaks here and there. Uh, of course, I need to uh, secure the battery better. It, it fell out. See, the other, the, the other 4003S's, I had Velcro on the bottom, which helped keep the batteries in the spot. This one's just free to slide around. So, uh, better battery mount. Uh, didn't break anything. Looks like all the pieces are still there. But I don't know why it decided to take off on an uncontrolled dip. I think I was flying this away with the I'll look in the video later. See the red is forward there. And for some reason or other it just kinda went like this and into the ground. But at least it, it ended up with the uh, the props on the upside after the crash. So, uh, props are loose, at least those two are. That one's not, and that one's not. So it must have been from the impact that uh, the props stopped, but the motors kept going. So they, uh, the nuts backed off just a teensy bit. But it's got promise. Uh, so I'd like to know how long this battery is going to last. I might look on eBay for a... Uh, Free cell 30C 4000 milliamp and see what happens there. So, uh, but first I gotta, uh, the motors are so tight, I have a prop replacement, which means I'm gonna have to order some more props, which means I'm probably gonna look for a three blade or a nine by five uh, set to put on it. Okay, later.